All right, so as we're talking about sound, this is actually one of the neater applications about it to really get you thinking about it. So what you notice here, you have three different glass bottles. Now the bottles themselves are all the same. What's different though, is if you look at the amount of water I have in each one. The one on my right, the water level's filled up to here. The one in the middle, the water level's up to here. And the one on my left, the water level's up to here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm first gonna tap on each of the water bottles, and then I'm gonna blow across the top. So I want you to pay close attention to the sounds that you're hearing. Now I'm just going to do just the ends this time, so the one with the least and the one with the most. So write down your observations, what can you see happening here? Now I'm not asking why yet, but I just want your observations. Now the next part, what I'm going to do is I'm going to blow across the top. So again, taking out the middle, the one with the least amount of water, the one with the most amount of water. Again, write down your observations. Pause it, write down all your observations, then let's come back. Okay, now that you've paused it, let's talk about this a little bit further. So what you hopefully observed was the one with the least amount of water had a lower pitch when I blew on it, but the higher pitch when I tapped on it with the pencil. So the question I want you to be thinking about now is try to figure out why. What's our model? What is it that's making it this one with more water, a lower pitch when I tap on it, but a higher pitch when I blow across the top of it? So we're going to pop, I want you to pause it for a second, and then we're going to go and we're going to explain it. Okay. So now that you pause and come up with some ideas, we need to think about what is sound. Well, sound is vibrations, and those vibrations is how we hear things. Well, what you need to really be paying attention to is what is making the sound in both cases. When I tap on it, or when I blow on it, what's making the sound, or rather, what is vibrating? So when I tap on it, it's the glass. When I blow across the top, it's the air. So think about how the water column here, where there's a little bit of water, how does that affect the glass? And how does that affect the air inside the bottle? So this one, there's more water. Tap on it, lower pitch, blow on it. So with that hint, figure out why is it doing each of these different cases? Turning your answers to me on the sheet. We'll catch you next video.